you have been tapped for what could be a career high um, project to work on, or you have been contacted for what could be your largest prospective client um, acquisition yet. So exciting. You're so prepared, yet those little voices in our heads often say, oh, I don't know if I can do this or not. Oh, I'm not sure if I'm ready or not. Maybe I'm not experienced enough. You know, I'm not really sure what they want or what they expect of me. I'm not sure if I even got the work or if I'm on the assignment, if I could actually live up to their expectations. Does that sound familiar? I have been there too many times. Time after time after time, I have almost talked myself out of perhaps once in lifetime opportunities professionally because of the, the inner critic, the self doubter. And what is even more impactful, it can be those comparison gremlins. Let me tell you my sweet friend, if we stay focused on the prize, knowing that this project or this client is gonna help us advance professionally and help us meet our goals, there's no time for all that inner chatter. There are tons of exercises and practices that we can help you uh, integrate into your daily practice, just a couple of minutes a day to help that mind chatter stop. It is a saboteur to our success, our happiness and our fulfillment. Um, we all have it, it's so normal, it's so human in all of us. The ones that move forward beyond it are the ways that are the ones that are learn how to tame our saboteurs and listen to our gut, our internal voices that we know that we're qualified, accomplished, uh, competent, highly responsible, highly customer client centric. We have everything that it takes to be successful right now. So if I can help you quiet that inner critic, that self-doubter, um, the comparison gremlins that can totally sabotage and take you off center and take you off what you know that you're trying to accomplish, please reach out to me. I would be my delight to help you walk you through that. Um, and again, it's not anything wrong with you. We all have it. So here's wishing that you can move forward with one voice, and that is your solid, powerful self.